can be solved by <laughs> magnet insoles. Remember those? Yes. Now, like I say, she's going to the line, and y'all let her stop, and y'all say what she told you to, and then do it all the way through like that. Because everybody here now is thinking, go ahead. Okay. I, I'll state your name. Dr. Senadino.
the people out there think live by. Okay. Well, I agree and disagree because St. James got it, Perry County's got it. St. Louis. We know bigger than they are. We can't have that. It just don't make sense. Well, that, that's still up to the people. It should be up to the board, but I don't know. That's not, to me, it ain't a board issue. It's the people that you, or they want to know. It's not a board issue. I think we should uh, find out uh, one way into another uh, because uh, I personally know several people who against it and I know several people who are for it. And uh, irregardless of who is for it or who is against it, if it passes, then there will be restrictions and if it interferes with the neighbors or smell or things, it's just like sure. any other animal, then there would be something done about it. But that's, I mean, that's one clause that would have to be in there on anything like that. But I think we should just let it run until we try and get something and get some senses on it one way or the other. Mm -hmm. um, All right. Yeah. But I mean, hey, it's no big hurry. It's been here, we've been here 50 years or so, and then, well, we used to have chickens. Yeah, there wasn't a horse there. We had them before, but you know. Like it's, been it's, been a it's been a mentor, it's been a mentor for a long time. Yeah. I don't care, I don't want anything got that much for I would buy a I got a truckload coming tomorrow now, I don't know what it is. Thanks a lot. Thank Is that the truck 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 Well, I don't need it then. Okay. Because I didn't get a report from the police department. Well, I got it right here in front of me. What? I thought you didn't leave one. Oh, oh, give it to him. Yes. I can't read that fine. That's why I said That's all she got to read. Read, read it to him. <laughs> all right. He said um, he apologizes for not being able to make the meeting tonight. Um, he has to be in St. Louis for work at 6 o'clock. Um, for the previous month, I've been working on uh, working with the city hall on some ordinance violations. Um, if an announcement could be made at the meeting tonight about keeping wands and weeds under control, uh, the citizens in the citizens' yards, that would be great. Um, as we get into the summer months, citizens have noticed in our reporting high drafts such slash weeds, and I have investigated. So. She said, he said, I would prefer to talk to the citizens to find a solution instead of keep writing something for them, keep giving them tickets. We, we told him that they were done. Yes. Um, at the last city meeting, I know having livestock, specifically chickens, within city limits was brought up. Sure enough, a day or two after the meeting, a citizen reported a home that had chicken, chicken, a chicken coop in their backyard. Is that the same one? Um, I haven't found any violations of the city ordinance since then. Uh, he said he has gotten a few calls for Marion Cliff for various, various things, um, but the residents and staff appear to be ready for the summer months as well. Uh, he said he's always available via email or phone slash text anytime. The city flip phone is still not operational, and I'll be bringing that back on my shift again on Monday. I don't know why it's not operational. Um, and then he said he'll be out of town at the beginning of July. At the beginning of July. I'm very unsatisfied. And I will, and he said he'll be on duty the 12th, 13th, 14th, or 12th, 13th, 15th, and 16th. Why work on Monday? There's uh, nobody here who remains closed on Monday. He comes and works every Monday. We still, got, here we still Monday. got feeders. We still got ordinance violations. Yeah, you see the line marks up and down the road. Huh? Nothing being done about that. What? All these black marks. You go from the highway, drive all the way down the highway. He's got to see it. He's got to see it. He's got to be here to catch it. Huh? Every weekend, I have my team here. We've got a part time cop running. Yeah, I know. He can't catch all that. Yeah, well, we need to find somebody here. Well, then we need enough money to get a full time. I'll let you know right now and put my letter of resignation in because I'm tired of it. You guys, we've discussed this many times. 
How many times have we discussed this and nothing's been done? We can't get a cop. We can find a cop. No, we're not that full time. We can find one that's going to work part time that's going to do something. He's going to do it today. Well, sure he was. I'm not going to argue with you. Yeah, well, I'm not either. I'm done. Okay. Just my letter of resignation will be in by Monday. Okay. Okay. I'm done. That's up to you. Sure it is.
cut way back with the heat and mm -hmm. no rain. Maybe they can do something about it. Okay. But these colors are supposed to be. They not a color on 61 around her, but the water goes through except on 8th Street. They go around. But they won't fix them. They will, but generally, but they won't fix them. Anymore. Yeah, this is a double issue that you mentioned before is that the asphalt's building up. One more uh, resurfacing will probably put the road higher than the sidewalk. Yeah. I can almost guarantee it. And then uh, that's kind of unsightly and it's a known loss there, but it's a risk for pedestrians. And a lot of people got that phone, Dave out there. They keep building, they showed up, and then he comes out with a tractor, something and drags almost because the hump is getting so high. Uh -huh. They said they take care of it, don't they? Right. We'll get, uh, I think Dennis is working tomorrow. Maybe one of the good time we'll go down and look at it and see what we can do. On Friday, uh, well, tomorrow I'll, I'll hit it with the weed or stuff like that. But I, I, yeah, then again, we only out. got part time work on that. We don't have no full time. We can't even get an application for that. Yeah. And I won't get an application. We'll get glad to not have one, but nobody put in an application to work. Wastewater, water, wastewater, is important. Uh, wastewater side, we had our uh, uh, DNR inspection last week. Um, around everything was, uh, he was actually impressed with everything that was going on at the plant stuff and how it was being ran. Uh, he did have a couple, a couple issues. Uh, one of them was this sludge tank, but turn around, he understands. Uh, they're gonna write up a report uh, for the city here uh, explaining what we can possibly do and they're going to try to see if they can uh, give us some help of doing things um, on that part. Uh, all the samples have been great down there and I mean everything's been looking pretty good down there on the mix liquor and stuff so that's all I have on the series side. On the water side we turn around and I'm uh, had a couple of technologies with the tower, uh, got them straightened out. Uh, started around waiting on some parts uh, to resolve the issue all the way. Because uh, basically, we have to do manual right now, uh, putting things in manual a little bit here and there, but it's not no big deal. Uh, the other thing is, we got a little bit of high usage on water. Um, Turn around, you know, it's been hot, you're out, people probably been watering their gardens, I don't know, we, we won't know that until I do the meter readings this month, so, um, to see how much water issues we've been actually going through with the residents out here, but, uh, if you guys notice any water coming up out of the road or anything, let me know, let Katrina in April, somebody know so I can check it out, um, because, uh, I think that A Street was a fault of mine, I think, Clark County must have done something, it, it was. They did some washing down there. I asked Larry about it. They were doing some washing down there, so they got me down there. The issue did, and then we yeah. quit running. Um, the other thing is grinders. Had a few grinders we had to work on. Uh, turn around. Uh, everything, I guess, been going good with them. Haven't got called back. I guess uh, a couple of them had to clean the floats off, and they started working again properly, so I haven't got a call on them. Uh, I still got to do some backfilling work. And a couple of them I dug up, just had, had a chance to jump on them, get them. So uh, hopefully in the next couple of weeks here I can actually jump on them and start back on them pretty good. But um, that's all I got to report. So, so what happened to this guy that's supposed to come in and put these grinders in the bars and try it out? I got a meeting on it from now. We're meeting on it right now. In the old station. It's a contract. Good. You can't do it. A contract can go with it. They've already decided that. Okay, they're going off. I apologize. Okay. Check this. Okay, Dad? That's it, I'll win. Cemetery Park? Yeah, the. Uh, regarding the dog. Uh, stuff that was mentioned before, dogs running off leash. <clears throat> Everybody's favorite town dog, I guess, is still running around. Uh, the I sent the.
the uh, copies of the ordinances to the parties involved, and I spoke with uh, the county officer regarding this, and uh, tickets have been issued for the, uh, regarding the box situation, and uh, that's not gone through uh, the court system yet. That's all I got for you. Okay. The citizens of this station.